Gary, a clinical display from Shrewsbury Town. What are your thoughts on your team's performance? Yeah, a difficult afternoon. Um, we knew it would be. You know, <laughs> they sit in top of League One for a reason, and um, they showed us why today. You know, they're finishing with clinical, as you say, and uh, it was a, it was a difficult afternoon. Do you think five 0 was maybe a little bit harsh on the shots? Well, you can look at it both ways. Um, yes, but they did create a lot of chances. Um, you know, our back line. You know, we we allowed them to get in quite a few times. So. Uh, but they were clinical with their finishing, and um, you can see why they've done so well this year. Do you think, despite the scoreline, all shot acquitted themselves well? No, the scoreline, the scoreline tells you a story. You know, it's difficult to take. Obviously, we we came up here to try and uh, make it difficult for the opposition, um, but that wasn't the case this afternoon. Were there any positives that you take from it? Uh, if we're jumping on the coach and going back home, <laughs> um, that's all I can say. Look, they're League One, they're looking to go into the Championship. We're in the National League, looking to try and get out of there. So there's a golf, um, and that was sh that showed up today. Fabian and, and Shamir came came back in. I thought Fabian particularly had a, had a good game. I think some of the Shrewsbury media have already highlighted his yeah. performance. He's a good player. We know that, and you know. We felt today that you know against the opposition as well, he would want to show that you know he's a decent footballer, and he is, and uh, he showed good moments today. And he extended his loan earlier in the week. Yeah. Having him for a longer period will be a real bonus. Yeah, it will be. Um, we knew you know what a, a good player um, we had coming into the club. Obviously, early on we needed to get him match fit, which I've highlighted before, and. Uh, He's obviously at that stage now where he goes on and, and plays and there's a spark, there's something you feel is going to happen when he's got possession of the football. Jake Cole wasn't involved this afternoon, that was an injury I presume because he wasn't even on the bench. Yeah, he picked up an injury in, in training which uh, is frustrating the hell out of me at the minute. Um, well, from day one of pre-season to today, uh, we've not been, not been able to field our strongest team um, and that is frustrating me but um, you know I haven't moaned this season I'm not going to start now but it, it has it's frustrating. You had to name Luke Skinner on the bench 17 year old his first involvement in a match day that's great experience for him. Yeah fantastic experience for him um, you know he's trained with us during the course of this season um, because he's had to. Uh, it's as simple as that. Uh, but not taking away the fact that he's, he, he, you know, he's got some ability there as well. So, uh, you know, he's one for the future. We'll see how he develops. But um, yeah, part of his development was sitting on the bench in an FA Cup tie, uh, which would be great for him. You said on Thursday this was a chance to for the team to to benchmark themselves against Shrewsbury. It's, it seemed for me, I've said just now, it seemed. A little bit harsh. There's clearly there's a gulf, but mm -hmm. there were some performances out there to take mm -hmm. into AFC Field next week with a home game that the shots need to win. Yeah, but everybody will look at the scoreline. Um, yeah, we wanted to do better. Of course, we did uh, in terms of the scoreline. Um, we wanted to do better in terms of our performance. But yeah, we showed little glimpses. Um, but the gulf showed up as well today. So. Uh, we have to dust ourselves down. Um, you know, it hasn't been a, a particularly pleasing week uh, after Barrow, but um, we have to dust ourselves down. We've got a game next Saturday at home against another good side, um, and we have to make sure that we uh, we pick up a win. Thank you, Gary. Safe and swift journey home. Thank you, Gary. Dave.